Step into the opulent world of the Colbys, a classic TV series that has left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. What enduring qualities transform this show into a timeless emblem of the television landscape? As you navigate through the glitz and glamour, keep an eye out for your favorite classic Hollywood actor gracing the screen. Now, let's delve into some captivating facts about this iconic series. The Colbys, a spin-off of the equally renowned dynasty, unfolds against the backdrop of wealth, power, and familial intrigue. As you witness the intertwining lives of the Colby family, the narrative weaves a tapestry of ambition, betrayal, and unexpected alliances, all set in the lavish world of the rich and powerful. Among the notable cast, classic Hollywood actors bring their charisma to the small screen adding an extra layer of allure. Each character impeccably portrayed contributes to the show's lasting impact. Who was your favorite classic Hollywood actor in this saga of wealth and drama? As you reflect on the Colbys, we invite you to share your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this timeless series. What moments left an imprint on your viewing journey? We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. So, whether you're a devoted fan or a newcomer, explore the legacy of the Colbys and join the conversation. What enduring qualities draw you in, and who is your standout classic Hollywood actor? Share your thoughts and let the nostalgia flow. Barbara Stanwyck, initially committed to a limited role in the second season of the Colbys, made an abrupt exit after just one season. Stanwyck, dissatisfied with her character's development and the overall show, successfully negotiated her departure despite originally agreeing to appear in six or seven episodes. Her unexpected exit brought a notable shift to the dynamics of the series. Interestingly, Catherine Ross, who portrayed a mother on screen, is only 16 years older than John James, the actor playing her son Jeff Colby. This age proximity adds a unique aspect to the mother-son relationship depicted in the series, defying the typical age dynamics seen in such family roles. The choice of filming locations for the Colbys also contributed to the show's authenticity. The exteriors for Colby Enterprises were filmed at the first Interstate Tower in Los Angeles, while Zach Power's headquarters scenes were shot at the nearby Bank of America building. This decision to use real, powerful corporate locations mirrored the rivalry within the show's fictional business world, drawing parallels with the competitive dynamics of the actual companies during that time. The selection of these iconic buildings for filming not only enhanced the show's visual appeal, but also reflected the strategic choices made by the production team to align the series with the corporate rivalries of the era. In summary, The Colbys, despite its brief run, witnessed significant behind-the-scenes developments, including Stanwyck's unexpected departure and the unconventional age dynamic between on-screen mother and son. Additionally, the show's commitment to authentic filming locations contributed to its portrayal of corporate rivalry within the narrative. Faye Dunaway, initially considered for the role of Sable Colby, declined due to salary disputes, leading to a series of rejections from Diana Rigg and Susanna York. Eventually, Stephanie Beecham took on the pivotal role, portraying the mother of Tracy Scoggins and Maxwell Caulfield, despite being merely six years older than Scoggins and 12 years older than Caulfield. This casting decision added a unique twist to the family dynamics, echoing the unconventional age relationships seen in the series. Interestingly, Tracy Scoggins, who played the twin sister of Miles Colby, is six years senior to Maxwell Caulfield. This age gap brought an intriguing element to their on-screen sibling dynamic. These casting nuances, marked by declined offers and unexpected age dynamics, became defining aspects of the Colbys, contributing to its distinct flavor within the realm of 1980s television dramas. Notably, Charlton Heston offered the chance to continue his role on Dynasty post-cancellation, declined due to unmet salary expectations. These behind-the-scenes intricacies shed light on the challenges and choices that shaped the trajectory of the Colbys, leaving a lasting impact on its brief yet eventful run. Considered for a major role in the Colbys were Angie Dickinson, Rula Lenska, Kate O'Mara, and Elizabeth Ashley. This reflects the extensive casting process that played a crucial role in shaping the ensemble of the 1985 TV series. The selection of cast members had a profound impact on the dynamics and flavor of the show, showcasing the deliberations and considerations involved in bringing the characters to life. 
Transitioning beyond casting, when the Colbys faced cancellation in 1987, some actors like John James and Emma Sam seamlessly transitioned to continue their roles on Dynasty. This move not only demonstrated the interconnectedness of television dramas, but also highlighted the enduring appeal of certain characters beyond the confines of a single series. Furthermore, a noteworthy aspect emerges when examining Charlton Heston's involvement. Before accepting the role of Jason Colby, Heston was contemplating a run for a U.S. Senate seat in California. This political consideration adds an intriguing layer to his decision to join the cast, providing insight into the behind-the-scenes dynamics that influenced the course of the show. In conclusion, the casting considerations and subsequent transitions to Dynasty, along with Charlton Heston's political contemplation, offer a glimpse into the multifaceted aspects that contributed to the narrative and longevity of the Colbys. These behind-the-scenes elements provide a richer understanding of the series beyond its on-screen drama. Maxwell Caulfield's connection to the Colbys extends beyond the show itself. Coincidentally, he played the character Michael Carrington in Grease 2. This interesting tidbit adds a layer to Caulfield's career, showcasing his versatility across different projects. The Colbys, known for its unique casting choices and behind-the-scenes dynamics, evidently drew talent with diverse experiences. This connection to Grease 2 serves as a testament to the varied paths actors take in their careers, bringing distinct facets to the characters they portray. Such intriguing details contribute to the multifaceted nature of the Colbys, offering audiences more than just a television drama a glimpse into the rich tapestry of its cast members' careers. The age differences among the senior Colby siblings were striking. Barbara Stanwyck, portraying the matriarch Constance Colby, stood 16 years older than Charlton Heston, who played her brother Jason. However, she marked a staggering 33-year age gap with Michael Parks, who portrayed her other brother, Philip Colby. This vast range in ages brought a unique dynamic to their on-screen family ties, reflecting a diverse range of experiences and perspectives among the Colby siblings. This age contrast was not the only noteworthy aspect behind the scenes. When the producers proposed a list of established Hollywood stars to play a love interest for Constance, Stanwyck opted for a different route. She declined the list and pushed for Joseph Campanella, a younger and less renowned actor she had briefly collaborated with on The Big Valley. This decision showcased Stanwyck's influence and preference, leading to an unexpected casting choice that added depth to the series. Amidst casting rumors, Doris Day's potential involvement in the role of Constance Colby created buzz. While it remained a rumor, the mere consideration of such a prominent Hollywood figure highlighted the level of speculation and interest surrounding the show's casting decisions. These backstage insights into the age dynamics among the senior Colby siblings, Barbara Stanwyck's casting preferences, and the speculation around Doris Day's involvement offer a glimpse into the intriguing behind-the-scenes elements that shape the narrative and character dynamics of the series. As the curtains close on our journey through the captivating narrative of an era past, your connection to the vibrant tapestry of the Colbys undoubtedly holds a trove of cherished memories. The intertwining tales of love, ambition, and intrigue wove a spellbinding narrative that resonated with many, embedding itself in the fabric of our cultural nostalgia. Reflecting on this remarkable series often brings forth a mosaic of emotions, a testament to its enduring impact. Whether it's the intricate character dynamics, the opulent settings, or the riveting plot twists, each element served as a thread weaving its way into the hearts of viewers. Your unique perspective, your personal connection to the lives of the Colby family, holds immense value. Your memories and thoughts encapsulate the essence of this timeless series, painting a vivid portrait of its significance in your life. We invite you to share your treasured reflections, to let your voice join the chorus of those who found solace, excitement, and inspiration within the world of the Colbys. Your contribution adds depth to this collective experience, enriching the tapestry of nostalgia that continues to endure. Thank you for your time, for allowing us to journey through the corridors of memory together. Your thoughts are a testament to the enduring legacy of the Colbys.